Have you ever raised your Windows computer look as sleek and perfect as macOS? Well, with few tricks and tricks, we can achieve this beautiful macOS look without breaking the bank. In this video, we are diving deep into the world of Windows customization, showing you exactly how to transform your Windows desktop into a macOS masterpiece. Well, I'll cover everything from the team and Keza to the dog and ridges. So, well, get ready and let's take your Windows experience to the next level. To get started with this video, I've provided a full zip file which is going to contain all the files you are going to use in this video and you can just download it from our Telegram channel channel and just extract it on your desktop once you've extracted it you are going to see a whole lot of files inside this zip file and the first thing i recommend you do is to change the wallpaper to this macOS wallpaper which i downloaded online once we've set the wallpaper what we are going to do next is to change the icons on our windows computer to make it look like mac os icons so i've provided a folder inside the mac os for windows which is called 70 sp icon tips open it up we are going to see this 70 sp gui just run this file once you've run this file, just click on add a custom pack and here what you have to do is to open the folder on your desktop and open macOS for Windows, open 70SP icon and here choose 70SP macOS blue and click on open. Click on yes and here what we have done is we've loaded this icon pack into the 70SP which is going to patch our Windows system to install the macOS icons on our windows so just click on start patching and here what it does is it's really going to install all the icons which looks like macOS on our windows computer and it's really nice so if today is the first time watching my video what i recommend you do is to subscribe to my channel where i bring to you all the exciting macOS look or any windows team which may look perfect on your windows computer so just subscribe to the channel hit the bell icon and also like the video if you truly find it helpful for you so let's wait for it to done installing and after that it's just going to tell you to restart your computer once the installation is done and you've rebooted your computer you are just going to see that your this pc and the recycle bin icons have been changed to this macOS icons together with all the icons in our file explorer and it's really nice the next thing we are going to do is to get this macOS team on our windows explorer which is really going to take our windows explorer to the next level so to get this macOS on our windows explorer the first thing we are going to do is to open this macOS folder and you are going to see windows 11 22 82 team just open it up and here just select all the files here and copy once you've copied it go to your this pc look at this go to windows and here look for resources once you found resources just open team folder inside it and paste all the files here Once you've pasted this here, what I recommend you do is to go back to your folder on your desktop and click on the folder. Here you are going to see Ultra US Team Patcher. Just run this file and it's really going to patch our system for us to use any custom team we want to use. Sometimes when you install this file, it's going to tell you to reboot your computer. Sometimes too, it's just going to tell you to just move on so if it's telling you to reboot your computer kindly reboot your computer and come back to the video and let's continue so after you are done installing this just go to settings once you are in your setting head to personalization go to teams and here you are going to see new teams added to your windows teams here i recommend you choose any of the team to see how it's going to make your file explorer look so I chose this one and my file explorer is looking like this it's not looking really nice now and the next thing we are going to do is to just head back to our folder again and it's open the start all is back and here you are going to see start all is back here just run this install for everyone once the start all is back is installed you are going to see this pop up just click on proper windows 11 and here go to explorer in this explorer tab choose win7 command bar 
and here i recommend you turn off this and this and here turn on this and turn off this one too close your file and just open your explorer and you are going to see that your windows explorer is looking a bit nicer again but this is not the total achievement we want we want such a sleek and a beautiful one so what we are going to do next is to open our old new explorer here and here we are going to see a files here just go back and here select the folder and copy once you've copied it head to your document and paste it here once you've pasted it here just open it up and run the explorer old new explorer once you've opened it up make sure you select all this and turn off only this one make sure the rest is turned off and click on install once you've installed it just close it up when we open our settings again and we head to the teams we are going to see that some teams comes with some teams comes with our menu bar heading and some two comes with the menu bar so make sure you choose the one which suits you well to get all this so I recommend choosing this one which will bring the forward and backwards and everything here so I'll just close it up and just hit continue so now you've installed our own new explorer head back to the folder again and here we are going to see this left side I just copy this folder once you've copied it go to document and paste it here just open it up and here you are going to see left side here just run it as an administrator once you've run it you are going to see that your title bar which contains the closing and the minimizing buttons has been moved to the left side of your windows and it's now looking like mac os but still this is not the total achievement of what we want so you go back into our folders again and here we are going to see explorer blur just copy this one too and go to document and paste it here once you've pasted it here just open it up and here you are going to see register just run it as administrator again and it's also going to make our windows explorer pretty cool so this is the final look of how we want our windows explorer to look and now it's re looking really beautiful and what i'm going to do again is to set the wallpaper again because the team has removed our wallpaper from it so this is the final look of our explorer and it's really looking really really nice look at that how blurry it is and it looks really perfect the next thing we are going to do is to install our dog which is really going to look like the same macOS dog we normally see on macOS devices so to install this dog open the my the dog and here you are going to see my dog finder just right click on it and copy once you've copied it go to your this pc looker and here just paste it here once you've pasted it here just open it up and here scroll down you are going to see doc 64 just right click on it and click on open click on allow and look at that this is beautiful look at this beautiful macOS dog on our windows computer and it's really looking really really nice now the next thing we are going to do is to just right click here and click on preference once you've taken this preference it's going to open this pop-up just go to advance here and here scroll down you are going to see manage backup files click on it and choose some course and click on ok and click on ok again and it's really going to restart your dog and bring out this perfect log and it's really really nice so here is the my dog finder which has this cool minimizing and maximizing animation and it's really really nice so 
the next thing we are going to do again is to go to preference again and see if our dog can restart itself or come back anytime we reboot our computer here instead of just click on this one and choose start as a service which is going to start our dog anytime we restart our computer and it's really really nice so now we are done with this just close it up and now we have achieved this beautiful macOS dog which is looking really really nice now the next thing we are going to do is to bring up our beautiful macOS widgets on our windows computer so just open the folder again and here you are going to see remeter here just click on it and run the remeter once you've run this remeter you are going to see ram remeter make sure it's checked and click on finish and here what it's going to do is going to load eight default remeter skins just right click on each of them and unload their skins once you are done unloading the skins you are going to see You are going to see that there's a monstrous skin in our remeter folder just run it and click on install and with this it's going to give you you a pack of macOS widgets for windows and it's really really nice so in this video you can just feel free and just go with your own widgets that you prefer or go with my which i'm going to choose and it's really really nice and this widgets come with very very cool features like this one you can just make it wide and it's really going to make your dog wide so what i recommend you do is place it anywhere on your windows computer you prefer to make it look sleek and beautiful so i'm just going to add the clock the calendar and also maybe the music which is really really nice so here i'm going to go with the wide again and place it here once I have this one, I just want to add the smaller one here, which is going to make my Windows computer a bit nicer. So I'm going to add this volume one. And it's really, really going to make my Windows really nice. Go with the small or maybe the medium. Wow, look at that. And here, if the widgets are looking big on your Windows computer, just head to appearances and here you can change the widget size to maybe 65 or any any amount you want. So I'm going to change this one to 65 and go with this one, which has really make it small. And when you want to change the padding to you can just change this patterns to maybe five or something. So, so this is my widgets and I'm going to place it here and anytime you play a video you are going to see the video over here or any music thumbnail over here and it's really going to be nice so once we've achieved this just open the folder again and the next thing we are going to do is to install the beautiful mac os Kesa on our windows and you can see a mac Kesa in folder in the files you downloaded and open it up in here just right click on install and click on install once you are done just click on settings in here what we are going to do is to change our mouse Kesa to this mac os Kesa. so go to teams in here you are going to see Mac mouse Kesa here just click on it and choose mac os once you've choose it just click on ok and it's going to change our windows Kesa to this beautiful mac os Kesa and it's really nice so once you've achieved all this then the next thing we are going to do is that when you look here we are seeing some rounded animation here but on a mac os pc it just looks like a mac os icon so what i'm going to show you is how you can change this icon to this mac os icon so just right click on your dock and click on preference here scroll down here my finder there just click on look and view and here click on this one and choose select file once you've chosen it head to the place you, you placed your my dog finder and here scroll down you are going to see teams click on apple logo and here you are going to see that your logo has been changed to this apple logo and it's really really nice 
the next thing we have to do is to just hide our desktop icons which is going to make our windows computer a bit clean and professional so this is that for this video and the last thing i'm going to show you is that when we right click here we are going to see that we can show our taskbar and when we show our windows taskbar we are going to see that it's looking a bit bad i don't know if yours is shown down here or something but you are going to see it's not really really nice so the next thing we are going to do is to customize our windows taskbar to make it look a bit nice so to do that just right click on the taskbar and click on properties once you've chosen that it's, it's going to take you to this property session and we, are ca we can do a lot of tricks over here so the next thing we are going to do is to go to the taskbar here and what we are going to do is to click on the plus icon and here head to your desktop open the folder and choose start all is back and here select this folder select all and click on open once you've chosen them you are going to see that mac os icon has been added here and i'm going to go with this white one which is going to make my start menu look white and here what i recommend you do again is to choose small and here to choose small over here which is really going to make our computer taskbar really small and very nice so once you've done with this just close it up and one thing i want to show you if you really want to go with the default windows taskbar or start menu you can just right click here click on properties again and here on the start menu just click on the off button and just go to taskbar and here you are going to see this one to just click it off and click on restart and here what it's going to do is to install the default one which is the default taskbar and it's going to be under this place and now you can just right click anywhere here and just hide it and it's really going to make your windows computer clean so if you are having problem like me if i hide mine it doesn't hide just right click on it go to taskbar settings and here you can just go to taskbar behavior and turn on the automatically hide taskbar and what it's going to do is to auto hide your taskbar and it's really going to make your windows computer clean and this is really beautiful so this is it for the video and if you have any question or you are fa facing any problem just comment it in the comment below and i'll be very happy to reply you and give you a better solution to your problem if you are not subscribed to the channel please do well to subscribe which really helps me move on to make a lot of videos like this for you thank you for watching bye